it's new fox here. We're back from more Fallout 4. Let's get going. When we last left off, um, our so-called son wasn't even there, but his dialogue was. And now we're going to reach the reactor. Probably need to clear the rest of them out. Take them with me. Yes. I'm glad you were here to save me. All right, Sturgis. Fire it out. Didn't leave anything behind, did you? All set to get out of here? Absolutely. Let's get the hell out of here. You got it. I'm gonna teleport you to the detonation site, then set it to shoot the kid here back to the castle. Now you press that button extra hard when you get there. See you on the other side. Move. Attention all personnel. Evacuation order issued. Authorization locked, 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 locked. Please proceed to your assigned evacuation point. Thank you for your cooperation. This is some quantum leap stuff. Like preach. I can feel it wash over me. The heat before 
force, the radiation, the fear. It's the end of the world all over again. I close my eyes. I've seen my life before all of this, before the bombs. Everything can change in an instant, and the future you plan for yourself shifts whether or not you're ready. At some point, it happens to all of us. This wasn't the world I wanted, but it was the one I found myself in. The Commonwealth. My home. Ripped apart and put back together. I thought, I hoped, I could find my family, cheat time, make us whole again. This time, I'm ready. Because I know war. War never changes. Uh... <laughs> He's like, preach. Did issue the evacuation order, right? I'm noticing all the chaos. Yeah. We gave everyone a chance to get out. Good. I thought so. It was just watching that explosion. I just hope as many people as possible got out. I hate that we had to do this. But they left us no choice. It was war. But now, the war against the Institute is over. The way is now clear for the Commonwealth to finally I'm gonna have to end the episode here. If you like, please subscribe. Stay tuned for war. <laughs> More. And always remember war. War never changes.